alright, y'all. I expect some action tonight, y'all. Enter and surrender. Don't you fight, y'all. I'm colorblind and other rhyming black and white, y'all. It's interesting how the instruments excite y'all. To rise up, open your eyes up. Salvage enough souls and live your lives up, huh? Happy birthday, Jared. And she smile, cause she cry. What you really just to be, child? Watch them flip with the real shit sell. We got a dance called the real sell. Happy birthday. It's always good news. Now give me five on it. Should I survive on it? And my cup of money over, so no need to be really old. But even so, I've got enough to feed the needy. I'm not to give up. Optimism. And I won't stop from spitting on top of the river. And I'm not forgetting those locked in prison. They can lock you in them, but not the wisdom. Watch them flip with the real shit sell. We got a dance called the real shit sell. Come on. Good job. charity Feed the Children. Fuse does own uh, two other beverages. One is NOS Energy Drink and the other one is Rehab Recovery Drink, which is right here. And we are currently owned by Coca-Cola now, so that's a big deal. We always want to be involved in the community. Um, I've lived here for 25 years, so any way that I can help uh, with any charity, sponsorships, um, we do have a budget that is specifically for events like this. Um, I always try and get us involved in doing something like this that we can give back. You know, rehab is actually only available in Arizona and Nevada. And we do have a, a big tie-in with the Hard Rock Hotel um, and Casino in Vegas. We are also part of their big um, rehab Sundays at the pool. So rehab is one of their recovery exclusive drinks out there at the pool, which is every Sunday. Um, like I said, it's only carried in Arizona and Nevada. And our company is based out of Inglewood Cliffs, New Jersey. So I would say it's pretty exclusive to the Southwest rehab. Can't find it anywhere else. As far as what we're doing, we're doing big things. I'm blowing up Arizona, so you never know where we're going to be next, actually. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jared. You are like, what, 20 years old? Happy birthday. So, tough day, huh? It was. You know, actually, one of my cousins died, and uh, I got into an accident, so it was a tough day, but hopefully everything will get better tonight. You know, we got to celebrate her life, I guess, and uh, you know, know that for the time she was here, she did the best that she could with everything, so uh, it's got to, I don't know. But, you know, it's always going to be in the back of your head, you know. I was pretty close to Stephanie, actually, so it's always going to be in the back of my head for this whole night, for weeks to come, so I got to be able to deal with it. And uh, I don't know, you know, you just gotta, like I said, you guys got to try to celebrate her life and not really try to look at the negatives about it. And, uh, you know, Stephanie was a great person. We just got to look forward and, uh, you know, hopefully she's in a better place, and I know she is. Well, I'm moving to Portland on Sunday, and, uh, you know, I'm going to start getting ready for the season. And uh, 
just you know workouts, just getting ready, doing whatever I need to do, conditioning, lifting, whatever the things call for to get ready for the season. That's what I'm gonna start doing, getting ready for it. We like to give back to you know Arizona. You know, I'm born and raised here, and uh, I'll being able to give back to the community is something that I've always been really felt really strong about, and uh, I'm always gonna try to do that. And with right now, you know, whatever the proceeds we make, we're gonna give a little bit back to feed the children and uh, you know try to help them out a little bit. I'm 20 now. 20. I'm old. That's what they. Okay, so I don't think I'm going to pass about that.